Creating ad campaigns would be easy if you knew how each keyword performed and convert it before bidding on them. Fortunately, with SEMrush's ad history report for keywords, you can use your competitor's experience to eliminate trial and error in your own campaigns and proceed with confidence. Use real data to help you assess your competition by seeing which domains have bid on a keyword over the last 12 months. You can understand user intent by seeing which domains have the most success with a keyword. You can optimize your ads text, calls to action, and even forecast your offers by analyzing ads copy. It's important to see how many advertisers you compete with, how often they bid on their keywords, and what time of year you'll experience the highest levels of competition, as it'll help you plan precisely how your campaign will fit in. After entering a keyword, SEMrush will return a list of domains that have bid on the keyword in the last 12 months. A cell shaded blue means that we found your competitor's ad in that month, being triggered by the keyword that you've queried, and the number inside the blue cell indicates the position of the ad. Using an example like this, it's easy to figure out when you should bid on a particular keyword. Here, you can see that advertising on this keyword is relatively sparse, but there are a few advertisers who bid on the keyword throughout the entire year. Naturally, they appear to be those who specialize in frames, but interestingly, the height of activity seems to be from July to September. That's when retailers that happen to sell frames along with other items try to get a piece of the pie. This indicates a seasonal sales trend, and you can use this information to forecast your keyword bids. But how do you know if the end user is looking for picture frames or eyeglass frames when they perform a search using this keyword? This is called user intent, and seeing which domains continue to advertise on a keyword is a big clue into the mind of the end user. You may have noticed that none of these domains sell eyeglasses, and most likely, that's because other eyeglass retailers before you have already figured out that bidding on the keyword frames doesn't bring relevant traffic or increase their conversion rates, so why should you? You see, your competitors know what works because they've tested it over and over so that you don't have to. So now that you've decided what keywords to bid on, you'll need to know how to create attractive and actionable ads copy. Click on any of the blue shaded cells to show a slider that contains the ads copy from month to month. By analyzing the ads copy of these top advertisers, you'll see a few similarities, such as shipping on orders above a certain price, and a tagline that says how long they've been in business. Now this isn't a coincidence. Somewhere along the lines, one of these retailers figured out a good strategy, and through competitor analysis, the other retailer saw similar results. Now that you have some great examples of compelling ads copy, export the report to either CSV or XLS and create your own ads copy today. Good luck, and if you have any questions, please reach out to our customer support specialists.